No surprise, Celtic pride is bubbling across New England. There was a pep rally in Natick today, and the chief himself, retired player Robert Parrish, was there. So was WBC's Paul Burton. Go Celtics! Celtics fans are living the dream and relishing the past. As Celtics great Robert Parrish paid a visit to Dick's Sporting Goods in Natick, greeting fans and signing autographs. He's a legend, so <laughs> it's, it's a, he's a part of history, so it's one of those things that you treasure. It feels good, and not to mention the fans have been very warm and receptive to my presence here. Parrish, also known as the Chief, played in 14 seasons with the Celtics, where he won three NBA championships alongside Larry Bird and Kevin McHale. Today, he says he's proud of his team to be back in the NBA Finals. We got a chance to do something special, to be part of, of the legendary, rich history of the Celtics. So I am definitely cheering for them and wishing them the very best. Here in Natick, I don't know what fans were more excited about, meeting the Chief and getting a signed autograph by Robert Parrish or getting their gear, getting ready for game two of the NBA Finals. Either way, they know this could be history in the making. Oh, it makes you feel proud. And when you walk into the garden, you look up and you can say, hey, I'm a part of those, some of those banners up there. And this was my dad, my uncle, and Robert in Logan Airport in 1987. Celtics fan Christy Dezizian showed Parrish a photo her father took with him at Logan Airport decades ago. Celtics was just a huge part of my Boston experience and going to loads of games. Celtics fever is sky high, from face painting to shooting hoops, and of course, spending time with a legend is enough to make any fan feel special. It's pretty neat to, uh, to see him here. The original big three. I mean, you got to respect them. Thank you, for Robert, for all you've done for Boston and have the boys keep the tradition going. As for predictions, let's let the Chief call it. Celtics and seven. Celtics and seven. And seven. I think it's going to be a long, grueling series. In Natick, I'm Paul Burton, WBZ News.